Hey guys, it's B more here. Um, as you guys know, uh, or obviously, I got rid of my Cobra scooter, and I got this GoPed scooter now. It's a GoPed Sport. Um, let's see here. So I'm going to be doing a, I guess I don't really want to call it a rebuild, but I just want to repair the GoPed scooter. Um, I got rid of my Cobra scooter. I sold it. <clears throat> I went ahead, and as you guys see my little videos, amateur videos, uh, I pretty much fixed up the Cobra gas scooter. Had the thing doing like 32 miles an hour. Ran great. I had somebody come up to me and offer me a price I couldn't refuse. So I sold it, and <clears throat> it's been a while since so I've been on YouTube, um, and so now I got this GoPed gas scooter, and uh, it is a GoPed Sport. Um, so far, all I've done to this thing was paint the footboard on it. Uh, yeah, it's actually like a fluorescent pink. It kind of looks like Pepto-Bismol, I guess, on the screen here. But, uh, let's see here. Um, so, I painted the footboard here. Uh, when I got this GoPed, it was bad. It, uh, the back tire on it was bald. I threw that out. Um, I went ahead and bought brand new tires. This front tire here is brand new. I mean, it may not look like it because uh, I've rolled it around and stuff like that. You know, outside, just fooling around. Uh, this tire here is the other tire, the old one that was on the, the front of the scooter here. Uh, yeah, so I replaced that with a brand new one. I'm going to use this tire for the back now, and we'll go ahead and tear that one up. I actually have another brand new tire put up um, so eventually I'll have two you know a set of brand new tires on this thing um, for all of you to know about go pads these parts are hard to find um, and if they're not hard to find they're expensive uh, I actually got lucky and bought two brand new tires for 50 bucks and if you guys look online most of the tires you see, you'll you'll find one tire for fifty dollars, not two. So I got lucky with that. Um, as far as the motor here, uh, I messed up, I guess, and I either didn't have the spindle tightened down good enough, or I had the wrong spindle on it, and it kind of it snapped off the bolt inside of the spindle there so that's that's done unless I can drill and tap it um so what I did was I took the other spindle well I, I tried it again I put the spindle on and I tried welding it on this time and as you guys can see there if you can see that the welds yeah that didn't work either so now I have to get a crankshaft for this motor uh, and just start all over. Um, not to mention this, this here motor does not even run. So, I mean, it barely runs. So I haven't had a chance yet, but, uh, I guess I'll have to clean out this carburetor and stuff like that. Do like a rebuild kit. Um, and, uh. We should be good. But all of that will be in video. We'll do we'll do a part two. Um, this will be part one. So all that will be in the next video. Uh, let me see here. There, this here, I don't know exactly what you call that. Um, I don't know if it's a velocity stack or whatnot. But uh, I, I guess it would be the... Um, intake manifold yeah, that would be correct because this here's the carburetor intake manifold then you got your 
intake here. Um, this is actually brand new. I had to replace that. These hoses here. This actually has uh, two valves, guys. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know that or not. Um, some of you may know. You may be highly educated with GoPeds. But that's a valve right there. And you can't see it on this other side here. It's hard to see. But this here is the other hose. That's a valve right there. So it's got two valves. It's like this thing here is like a 25cc. Uh, it is a geo motor, I believe. 25cc. Um, but anyway, that, that's enough of that. Um, we'll do a part two on this uh, with all like the new parts and stuff. And I guess I'll show you guys like how to do some rebuild on the, uh, some rebuilds on the motor here. Whatever it is I'm going to do. I'll replace the crankshaft. Uh, you know, probably clean out this carburetor, get a rebuild kit, whatever. Um, and uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and get a new, uh, I forget what you call this, a coil. Yeah, for it. Because the teeth on this are, I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah, it's hard to see there. But the teeth on that coil are, uh, there you go. They're shot. They're rusted. They're just about gone. Um, so, yeah. I'll go ahead and do a part two, guys. Uh, if you guys can, comment. Give me your uh, input. You know, maybe you can teach me some things. Um, but besides that, like, share, subscribe. Um, main thing is subscribe. Uh, and share the videos. Um, I'm kind of new to YouTube, and I could use the support. But anyway, guys, this is, this is Be More here, signing out, peace.